what's going on? What's up? What's up? Welcome back to the channel. We are checking out a video that you have to listen to the second you get a mustache. Right whenever your beautiful mustache is in formation, as such. The only intelligent thing to do would be to listen to Rammstein. So that's exactly what we're gonna do today. Another live video because you guys cannot get enough of this. The last two videos that we did to Rammstein, y'all absolutely loved. So we are here checking out more. And today we got this song called Rom 4? Rom, Rom 4? I don't know. All I know is whenever I listen to Rammstein, I wish I was German. Sitzpinkler. Now, I'm, I'm already a quarter Austrian, but I know Austria is very different from Germany. There's some similarities. They both like schnitzel, but they're very different. Different. <laughs> different. They're very different. Anyway. Guys, let's check it out. I'm ready for some sheer fucking intensity. I'm ready to get my glitterous. Wait, what the hell did I just say? Uh, I said glitterous. Uh, I'm a man. Uh, we're, we're not, we're not getting any, we're not doing ourselves any more favors. Okay, uh, let's get it. Got the English translated lyrics pulled up. And guys, if you are not yet subscribed, the fuck? Hit that subscribe button for some more Rammstein. Let's go. <laughs> the countdown already, dude. The energy at these shows must be so unreal. God, I want to go to one so bad. And I'll just accept the fact I'm never gonna fucking see him because even if they tour North America, they're not coming to Hawaii. So, there's that. Have any of you guys met Till Lindemann? And if so, what is that man like? Aside from the fact that he probably smells like cinnamon. I just have a feeling. Oh my god. What are you doing up there? How fucking badass is that? Rammstein's god tier. They, they have reached such a high level of stardom and just sheer chaos. No, no other band can truly compare. Oh, dude. I love making Rammstein reactions for how, like, infectious their energy is. How positive it makes me feel after listening to it. Despite the fact that they set people on fire. I don't know why that makes me happy. My heart burns fire at will, ashes to ashes. What I love about Till's voice is it's so rich, right? There's so much grain to it. It reminds me, and this is gonna be weird, okay? Hear me out. It reminds me of like a stepdad that cares about you, you know? Like he's there and he's quite kind to your mom and he gives you gifts. He's got that voice, it's just like a comforting type of voice. I don't, I don't know what I'm saying. Rammstein! White flesh in the darkness, you smell so good. <laughs> 
And another cool thing about the band is just the sense of authority that they have. You're just so captivated and enthralled by what's happening that you just feel the need to listen to them. It, it feels like they have this higher sense of power, this musicianship where I'm just like, Jesus Christ, how do other bands compete? Oh, okay. Okay. Well, he's got a microphone cock. We want to disturb the peace. <laughs> And you got those fucking haunting ass riffs of Rammstein, right? It's so easy to get caught up in Till whenever you're thinking about Rammstein. Just like for me, whenever I think of Lincoln Park, I think of Chester, but let's shut the fuck up and enjoy the music. I never see Till smile though. Part of me just wants to know if he's having a good time. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Nine, Rammstein. <laughs> it's so fun, dude. It's fun. Ah. Uh. Rammstein! For me, dude, I love these live shows. That was incredible. And that was one of the, the tamest Rammstein songs I've heard, and they still had countless explosions. He used the microphone as his dick. But, but that was tame, it was nice, right? Now for me, I've fallen so in love with the live shows of Rammstein, like watching them online, because it gives me the sense that I'm actually there and it makes me feel like I'm experiencing the live show. Granted, I know that the live show compared to the thing I just watched is absolutely astronomically night and day different because just to be there, I'd imagine the energy is so intense that it probably makes you just want to vomit everywhere. You know what I'm saying? But just watching it like that gives me the littlest glimmer of hope that one day I'll get to check them out live. This is crazy. You take a horror movie and you take seven sticks of adrenaline and you pump it into that, and that's that's a Rammstein show. I would love to sit around with Rammstein and eat schnitzel and talk shit. Just talk about life. Not talk shit to them. That would be weird. Just over schnitzel, insulting them. That, that's weird. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for taking the time out of your busy schedule to check this out with me, and I will see you in the next one. Love y'all. Peace!